Hello and welcome. It's Dead Spider Venom here. And today I'm going to play Khajiit. Yes, a Khajiit. Why am I playing a Khajiit? Because I want to play Khajiit on Skyrim. Because I've not played Skyrim yet. Okay, well, let's get going. <laughs> um. Yes, I need my character silence. Silence of the lab. Tom Amagato Misto Robato. Okay, I'm done. I'm just joking. Yo, if you can tell, my quality is different because I am using a really nice mic. Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. The quality is a lot better this time. Freaking, I, I started recording earlier and the quality was like, ah, cry, cry. Like, I was getting like, Looks like we're the only one 11 FPS, it. not like 22 right now. That thing was a dragon, no doubt. Just like, like, granted, it's not very good, but it's better than what I was getting. Um, this game is going to be heavily modded, and when I say heavily, I mean heavily. But don't worry, it's not too mining. overpowered. I tried to keep it decently balanced. Actually, no, it's not overpowered at all. On, even the overpowered... Oh, sorry. Uh, even the overpowered mods are underpowered in this game. Well um, this don't game. worry, I'm not going to be doing uh, immersive first person forever, because, like, seriously, that would get sickening after a while, so I'm just going to do normal first person. Uh, that's for Go Oculus ahead. Rift whenever I get it. And I know it's dark. Granted, that's another mod. I'm uh, going to be getting a... Do you want to call it here soon? Right. Um... I'm gonna be doing heavy armor, and that's why I went storm cloak route at the beginning. Because the only way to get he heavy armor is to um, do storm cloak. Because for some reason, storm cloaks don't have heavy armor, so going imperial doesn't get you heavy armor at the beginning. Hmm. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh yeah, I should have installed. Um, don't worry, I do have UNP for. Our female armor mods and female physics and stuff like that but don't worry I should have fixed it fixed the nudity with a bikini patch so I shouldn't have to worry about taking off armors for those of you who know how to mod and crap yeah yo Kijit's freaking unarmored it's so overpowered it's not even funny it's like boom, boom, boom. Unlock that door. Let's get out of here. Lol. Her boobs are glitched. <laughs> um. Okay. Torch. Does this guy have a lantern? No. Okay, so I'm gonna have to wait to get a lantern. Okay, now I got a torch so you guys can see decently fine at least. Kettle. Oh, cabbage. I will take that cabbage. I got realistic needs that I'll be turning on after I get out of here. So anything and everything that can help me stay alive will be very, very good. And I literally mean I'll be taking, I'll be turning, I will be turning realistic needs on as soon as I get out of here. So the moment I get out of the tutorial section, I'm going to be <laughs> crying. Want to why? Um, let's just go through the mods. Well, I'm Let's go through the mods I have on real quick. Um, mod configuration. Apocalypse spells adds extra spells to the game. Granted, that's kind of OP a little bit. So convenient horses makes horses change a little different. Frostfall. This adds, for those who you do not know, adds weather. So pretty much, I can if I get cold, I can die. If I get too hot, if I get well, not too hot, but if I get wet, blah blah, that type of stuff. Uh, guild starter allows me to start a guild if I want. Uh, that don't worry about it. That was for an armor mod. It's just a 
it's pretty much when wearing high heels, you actually go that high or whatever, you know, your camera's actually that high type thing. Immersive armors, it adds a bunch of lore friendly and non lore friendly armors to the game. Crafting, painted spike, target. Crafting for shields, mm. but yeah, has a lot of games, armor options, Alduin scale armor, yeah, Alduin scale armor, paladin armor, hedge knight armor, oh my goodness, extras, it, it adds a lot of armor, same with immersive creatures, a lot of lore friendly creatures, though I do got another creature mod on, oh my goodness, uh, immersive FPS, moonlight tails, a uh, werewolf mod also includes um, uh, werebear. Yeah, NPCs in the dark. Pretty much. Um, just think of it like this: in the dark, NPCs actually use light and stuff. And if you're in the dark and you don't have light on, you will be harder to see. If you have the spell out, you'll be easier to see. Blah 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 blah. It just adds that. Player adjuster, adjust size. Uh, if I'm smaller, I run slower pretty much. If I'm taller, I run faster. Yeah. Realistic needs. I have to eat. I have to drink. If I drink alcohol, I get drunk. Pretty much that's it. Oh, and diseases will affect me horribly. Uh, the last altar. That's a spell making uh, thingy. Allows me to yeah, it's a spell quest. I probably won't do that until later in the game. Um, wearable lanterns. And wet and cold. And there's a lot more other ones. Uh, wet and cold. By the way, wet and cold is a... Um, I guess you could say enhancer for... Um, crossfall. Damn, that dragon doesn't give up easy. Um, but there's a lot more mods out there that I have installed. Yes, he has a lantern. Give me your lantern. I can drop this, put lantern on. Oh, wrong lantern. If you can find any potions, we'll need them. Wanna what? Fuck potions, I need food. Oop. Forgot not to swear. It's been a while. It's been a while. I blame the fact that it's been a while. So yeah, and the reason why I'm collecting all this crap now is because I'm gonna need stuff when I get out. The wine I'm gonna probably drink before I get out so I can get the empty bottles. So yeah, let's drink those right now. Empty bottle. So now I got some empty bottles. I question why I even check that. Like they're always the same items in those containers. Done. Let's get moving. Oh yeah, if you guys see things with like basic Nordic, don't worry about that stuff. No, I haven't seen him since the dragon. Uh because that stuff is just like um uh it, it's one of the mods, it's like Armory of Skyrim. It adds in more re it adds like a combo ar weapons in pretty much. Um, Okay, now I need to save here because I've always crashed right up here. And I don't want to keep on regaining this. Like there's something in this. See, that's how much I've redone it. This one section right here. Um, 
but it adds a bunch of ar different types of weapons in. Pretty much, I can make a. Uh, if I buy the book, I can make a. Um, Iron Dramora sword or scimitar. And pretty much what that does is that the the skin of the weapon looks like uh, an iron with the mix of Dramora and the main actual shape of it is Dramora. It, it actually looks pretty sick some of the weapons. Like it, you wouldn't believe how cool a glass Dramora looks. Orders are to wait until crap. Or other graphs. Okay, this is where it crashes on me. This guy right here. Always with this guy, it crashes. I go over, I kill this guy, I go to loot him, and it crashes on me. See, look, see how it says Steel Imperial Sword, not just Imperial Sword anymore. Iron Basic. Oh yeah, I'll be using a bow as secondary. Okay, at least it's not freaking crashing on me now. Like before, it was constantly crashing on me right here. And this is like probably the. F and that's what's funny because of the crash is the reason why I constantly had to redo this part because they kept on crashing on me and crap. I think it was because everybody's like using torches in this section and all the other effects. So yeah, that's pro oh sorry, that's my computer. Um, it's literally I'm leaning against my computer right now. I'm on the floor. <laughs> I'm on the floor. Don't worry, my computer's huge. Da -da -da -da. Immerse the first person. The rest of them will have to find another way out. Oh, god dang it, I forgot. I turned the immerse the first person on. There we go. Yeah, th this is one of the few parts that are actually really graphic intensive, like the beginning of the game. Once I get out, it should be decently fine. Oh, here come spiders. Here come spiders. I hate you. I hate you, you damn fucking spiders. Oh, God. Thank God. I'm just thanking the fact that I don't have, like, realistic needs on right now. Because if I had realistic needs on, that would be horrible. If you're doing that part, I would have just cried. It was right there when I got poisoned. Now I'm poisoned and I don't have a freaking antidote. Right there when I got poisoned, I would have just cried. You, you could say I would cry. Oh, sorry. You could just say I could. I would have cried a river. Sorry if I kind of sound odd, like I'm not paying attention. I am actually checking. Sorry if you hear that in the background. <laughs> I'm saying sorry a lot. Uh, but I'm checking to see if... Uh, what time it is. Because depending on the time, I might have to get off. Because I have to make a call. There's a spider over there. I never realized that there was a spi new spider over there. Lol. Defeats Gear Bear in two swipes. Oh my god, there's a lot of bear meat. Oh, random frost spider. Oh wow, this is an actual frost bite spider. What the hell? Stepping on a bone goes Ugh, and hurts me. Kajita's on the exit, yes. Where is the useless bomb? I can't continue on without you. This 
better, my helmet or the iron helmet? Imperial, my helmet. I accidentally exited out, exited outside with him one time. That's not fun. I had to like cheat and complete this quest, then cheat and start up the next quest. And it was all bugged out and crap. It was not fun. Sneaking is overrated, eh? Looks like the way out. You would make it. Sneaking is overrated, eh? Yes, that is. That's why I didn't do it. But you didn't help for shit. I say you didn't help for shit. Come on. Hermie. Hermie. Hermie, you're me, also. Blech. Lol. Hermie. Hurry your ass up. Oh. Yeah, down. Okay, I guess I'll write this one 18 anyway, because of the glitch. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was probably really loud. I'm sorry about that. Okay, no, I'm not. Boobies, boobies, boobies. No. I'm not like that. The only reason I downloaded it was for the armor mods that were compatible with. Then I tried fixing it, and, well, you see what happened. Glitch! I need, oh, I probably have to go there to get it. Okay, well, I will go there and get it later. I incorporated what are called skeletons in the modding community. For this, you don't know what skeletons are. They allow you to do thingies like, um, make boobs jiggle and butts jiggle. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, make it to where if you wanted to, you could break bones actually have odd angled arms and sp the splits <laughs> uh, it, yeah pretty much that's what it does it allows you to do different thingies oh d please don't tell me it froze didn't it it froze it did darn it okay I'm gonna end the pause the, end the recording right there um, next time you see me, I'll be out and about with everything activated. Audio.